Alright, hello everyone and welcome back to New Vegas. Continuing where we left off last time, I believe we just got to Novak and took a picture out in front of the big dinosaur. Yep, took a picture out in front of the big dinosaur. Oh, I see why they call it Novak. No vacancy. <laughs> Clever. All kinds of parts sitting around, but I can't take them. aren't necessary and reloading bench Some more uh, 10 millimeter ammo. My rusty old weathered 10 millimeter is probably my best little gun right now. I just love the fact that they modeled it after the original 10 millimeter in the first game. Anyway, enough workbench. Forgot how much uh, I enjoy these menus, Kappa. <laughs> just wanted to do a quick little bit of ammo recirculation. Oh, here's a familiar face. Hi there, Victor. Well, butter my butt and call me a biscuit if it ain't my old friend from Good Springs. <laughs> what are you doing in Novak? Don't rightly know. I just got the notion to make my way to New Vegas. Reckon I'll find out when I get there. <laughs> Cat with a cowboy hat in chat. Uh, so what's the story with this place? Novak? Nice enough place, I suppose. But between you and me, when I roll into town, my skin starts to itch. Watch yourself. Nice to see a friendly face out here. Likewise, friend. Likewise. Is there anything old Vic can do you for? Use a bed and some supplies. Well, this ain't New Vegas, but I reckon you can find what you need here. Try the office out front. You said the men that tried to jump me were heading this that jumped me were heading out this way, right? 
No, don't believe I did. But you might ask around. The Novak folk usually see anyone traveling this way. I'm not gonna be rude to Vic. Vic has been very nice to us so far. Goodbye, Vic. Be seeing you. See you later, Victor. Front office. Yep. Hello, ma'am. Oh my, how, how do I get one of these souvenir dinosaurs? Hey there. Please tell me you sell them. Well, welcome to you. You look tired from the road. Why don't you relax a spell? Let this fine town take care of you. Ask him what's your vector, Victor. <clears throat> Looking for a man in a checkered coat. Have you seen anyone like that? Well, he might have been wearing a fancy outfit, but he wasn't any kind of gentleman to me. Had his nose stuck so high in the air you couldn't see it above the clouds. Sounds about City right. City folk. They always think they deserve better than what they got. Those hoodlums he was with seemed to know Manny for some reason. He's our daytime sniper up in the dinosaur's mouth. Oh. Hmm, interesting. I'd like to rent a room. Well, I think that's a fine idea. I'll give you a good flat rate, and you can stay as long as you like. At least until the busy season comes. Sound good? Oh, uh, I guess we have a couple of caps we can spare. Sure, here's a hundred caps. I'm glad you can stay with us. Your room will be the one upstairs, closest to the lobby side. Here's your key. Let me know if there's anything I can do to make your stay better for you. So we got a permanent residence here, unless it's busy season. Awesome. She just uh, complained about the rude man, and you avoided the polite option. Uh, what is this place? We're in a little desert oasis, name of Novak. This is the Dino Delight Motel, and it's mine. What's been going on in town lately? Well, let's see. Dusty McBride's been losing some Brahmin, but that's probably the heat more than anything. Honestly, it's been real quiet. Ranger Andy's still hurt, but we got these two gentlemen snipers watching the road day and night, keeping the trash out of Novak. They've Fair been enough. a blessing. <laughs> Are you talking about this option? No, we haven't met yet. Uh, I guess we can go with that. I'm not entirely sure how they're going to read that. There's a couple of different ways that could be read as. Oh, what am I doing? I got to thinking about making a good impression and plain forgot to tell you my name. I'm Jeannie May. I take care of folks here at the motel, long as they aren't troublemakers. Oh, nice to meet you, Jeannie. Um, where can I get supplies? Go see Cliff Briscoe at the Dino Bike gift shop and tell him I sent you. Awesome. I think he gets lonely standing around in that dino belly all day. He'll be glad for the company. What is there of interest around here? Well, there's Dinky, the town mascot. He's a sight. You mm -hmm. probably already saw him when you came in, but you can go up inside too. Up awesome. the roadways to the west, there's Repcon. That's the old rocket factory. Ooh. There's been some sinister characters out there lately, so you may want to stay clear. Other than that, nothing to do but take it easy and enjoy good company. Anything else? Well, up north the ways, you'll see a big tower. That's Helios 1. Used to be a power plant in its day. And there's a town just east of here called Nelson. Used to be such a quaint little place until those slavers took it over. But we got our wonderful snipers keeping an eye in that direction, and so far, the slavers have left us alone. But 
Blow the slavers up! Yay! <laughs> Tell me more about Repcon. I just know what I've heard. <clears throat> There's supposed to be some ghouls that went in a while back. Ah. Ever so often, there'll be a commotion from that direction. Explosions and such. Watch out for strangers! Indeed. Watch out for stranger danger. Uh, I guess we're gonna have to go the other way to get inside of our hotel room. Oh, you're allowing us the sarsaparilla? Thank you very much. Sarsaparilla, indeed, on the house! Oh. Seems I must use some of it. <laughs> da. All right, one of these should be our room. I think it's this one. Yep. Here's our new room. Oh, I got a foot locker and everything. This place is awesome. Ooh, we even have a TV. It might even work. If I could get a use button. Nope, doesn't look like it works anymore. Ooh, and we got desk. Suitcase. Suitcase has got something on it, huh? Uh, pre-war outfit. Okay. Refrigerator? Do we have food in here? Indeed we do. Drinks! And let me guess. Yep, the bathroom. And some more pre-war clothing. Hmm. Is there anything I can drop off really quick? No, since I'm not using these right away. There. Lightens the load a bit. And actually, since we can put all the outfits in there, we might as well pull the outfit out of here and put it in there. Keep things somewhat organized in this place. And then we can store other stuff in the suitcase. Actually, I kind of currency goes into the miscellaneous, apparently. Oh, wow, yeah, look at how much bell caps we have. Yeah, we're doing pretty good on bell caps. Conductor's five pounds. We keep the conductor here. We now know where it is. We'll keep a few other extra odds and ends we don't need with us right away. Definitely don't need that. <clears throat> Have a storage facility for some of the stuff. All right. <laughs> oh, I should have put it in here. Oh well. Um. Oh, an empty safe. Wow. Okay. Well, I say we relax until the morning, anyways. It's probably late enough. Yep that uh, no one's going to be awake right now. <clears throat> Must be lots of fun at motels. I'm... I don't know. I, I try to keep things organized. We had a motel. <laughs> don't want to take up too much space. Gotta share it with other people. Alrighty. Welcome. Come on in. Hello. Welcome to the Dino Bite gift shop. My name's Cliff. If you're here for the T-Rex figurines, you're just in time. There's still a few left. Awesome. 
Uh, Jenny May sent me. Bless her. Seems like every traveler I get in here tells me the same thing. They see the sign and think, gift shop? That's just too good to be true. But Jeannie May always points them back in my direction. Well, a friend of Jeannie's is a friend of mine, and my friends get a discount at my store. Woohoo! <clears throat> you mean you're super excited about the furniture? Oh. <laughs> Well, it's our, technically our first home for this character. He's not really had a place to lay his head for a while. Oh, uh, let's see here. There's a tall ghoul and a cowboy hat been seen in here asking questions. Sure, but he didn't buy any souvenirs, if that's what you're wondering. I was, wonder I was wondering that. He would have been asking about uh, ghoul activity in the area. Oh, that. Lately, there's been talk of ghouls just a bit west of Novak, up in the mountains. Ah. Welcome back. Can I get you anything? What do you sell here? Well, there's T-Rex figurines, of course. That's our bread and butter. We also have an assortment of the Repcon factory souvenirs, rockets, things of that nature. What more can you tell me about the souvenir rockets? They're scale replicas of the real thing. Very detailed. Got a liquid in them that makes them glow. From what I hear, Repcon used to give them out on tours of their HQ up in Henderson. But I guess they had to stop after the first few kids thought they were filled with Nuka-Cola and drank it down. <laughs> the papers had a name for the condition and everything. They called it the Repcon Shakes. Those were bad times for Robco. How'd they end up here? Well, they unloaded what they had left on the dino bite as a tax write-off, but that was before my time. Plenty of demand for them, seeing as how they're one-of-a-kind collector's items, but I might still have some in back. What about supplies and guns? Do you sell those? Guns? I, uh, well, yeah, I guess I might have a few. Darn it, no one ever buys the T-Rexes. Oh, don't worry. I'm going to buy a T-Rex. I'd like to see what you got for sale. Sure thing. Have a look. I ain't leaving this town without a T-Rex, damn it. <laughs> yeah! Oh my god, he is expensive? We'll figure out how to get him. Uh... one of those rockets let's see here what can we get rid of here don't need that problem with Shetty is not that easy to keep well it's doing better than the brass knuckles right now actually <clears throat> we do not need all these things there we go quickly turn that around That dinosaur is good as mine. What else you got? It's good, sir. Does this crazy thing use for ammo? MF breeder? Never heard of it. Okay. <clears throat> Plasma defender. Plasma rifle. You had me at hello. Bye bye, brass knuckles. <laughs> K 
Too bad that venom. Don't really think we need uh, any of these. Definitely don't need venom on me. Jet. Don't use drugs, kids. <clears throat> Keep the mentats for now, just in case. Don't use psycho. Red X right away. Don't use rebound either. Anything else I can do to lower the price of this thing? What's this leftover junk? Actually, here. Take some of that. Only gonna cost me a few caps. All right. I'll probably come back with stuff I can uh, give to him later too. All right, goodbye. Come back soon now. Well, it looks like I picked the wrong week to stop uh, sniffing blue. <laughs> oh, wow. Like. How heavy is that dinosaur and that rocket? I would so love to add a dinky souvenir to my collection. <laughs> okay. God damn it. Don't sneak up on me like that. What do you want? Expecting visitors? Yeah, I guess maybe I am. But not like you. Huh. Maybe it should have been you I was expecting all along. Why are you here? If you're looking for someone in particular, I could tip you off if I see them. Yeah, well, you see anybody wearing Legion Crimson or a lot of sports equipment, you just let me know. You still haven't answered my question. Wanted to check out the view. I think you better leave. Just making for any conversation. I don't have friends here. Well, I'm not from. Well, I'm not from here. No, no, you're not, are you? Maybe you shouldn't go. Not just yet. Why is that? I need someone I can trust. You're a stranger. That's a start. Only trust strangers. I said it was a start. This town. Nobody looks me straight in the eye anymore. What do you want me to do? I want you to find something out for me. I don't know if there's anything to find, but I need someone to try. My wife was taken from our home by Legion slavers one night while I was on watch. They knew when to come, what route to take, and they only took Carla. Someone set it up. I don't know who. Trying to track down your wife? My wife's dead. I want the son of a bitch who sold her. 
What do I do if I find this person? Bring him out in front of the nest here while I'm on duty. I work nights. I'll give you my NCR beret to put on. It'll be our signal so I know you're standing with him. And I'll take care of the rest. I need to do this myself. I'll see what I can do to help you out. Good. I'll make it worth your while. And one more thing. We shouldn't speak again. Not until it's over. No one in town knows that I know what happened to my wife. Best they never know. Or the Legion will be after me next. Looks, uh, <laughs> looks like I picked the wrong week to stop sniffing glue. Well, I'm not here. Uh, not sure you're getting all my airplane references tonight. I need to do this myself, except for you doing it all. Yeah, right? <laughs> How do you know your wife is dead? I know, all right. That's all you need to know. Yeah. Friendly. Actually, she was saying that she wanted... What's up? I have a dinky the dinosaur souvenir for you. Ooh, thanks. That is a quality collectible. I am stashing that somewhere safe. There we go. <laughs> I don't like him, <laughs> says Ixi. Oh, do you see that giant uh, gecko? Whatever <laughs> that is? Over there. Can we go see that? I bet you can go inside. You just came in from there. We came out from in there. So slow. Don't know how I sold so much. And still I'm overweight. No, seriously, I sold a whole ton of stuff. I'm not sure what the hell's so heavy, but we're gonna find out quick here. How heavy is this thing? It's only six pounds, and that's like the one weapon I got. So I'm not sure what that, how that would cause the problem. I got rid of Dinky, and that one didn't wear anything. Wait, anything? The rocket? Oh, wait. Oh, shit. <laughs> wow. That would explain it. I bought all of the dinkies. <laughs> well, I have some stuff to sell now. <laughs> I have a backlog of all the dinkies. Maybe that's why they're expensive, right? It didn't tell me there's a thousand of them. Not that I recall anyway. But hey, I can make about 500 credits, uh, 500 caps back at least, usually, unless I can prove my barter. Can't believe I missed that. I was mobile. I didn't. It didn't tell me there's multiples. Is the thing too? I swear it didn't say anything about multiples. Usually, if you get multiples, it'll actually bring a pop up. And it didn't do a multiples pop up. It's really weird. Maybe I accidentally clicked and didn't notice it? I don't know.
other one. Where are you? Actually, rocket souvenirs as well. Oh. Apparently I need to keep it because it's a quest item? Head tilt? And he's now a table centerpiece. Perfect. No, you were good right where you were. There we go. Hee <laughs> hee. Little dinkies out one by one. Oh yeah, let's crash the game. <laughs> Than I have outside the 10 millimeter. Uh, we have a whole bunch of stuff to look at now. Quests. Oh my god, all the quests. Rock'em Sock'em Willow. Booted Rescue Captives. Source of Sierra Madre Invasion. They went that way. Ask around. Hi there. We haven't met yet. You must be new in town. I'm Andy. What do you hear, Andy? Right now, a whole lot of sitting on my keister and counting cracks in the ceiling. I wouldn't wish it on anybody. On better days, I help keep the peace. Boone and Vargas watch the road. I watch the town. Tell myself I'm doing some good. Can you tell me about Boone's wife? Carla was a knockout. Whenever Boone walked around with her, he always had this funny grin on his face like he couldn't believe his luck. I know we couldn't. That wasn't the only reason she stuck out, though. That girl never minced words. If she'd had better food or hospitality, she'd let you hear it. Trouble was, she usually had. I don't think she meant it. She really was a sweet girl. I think she just wanted to remind herself that there's still nicer places in this world than Novak. Who could blame her for that? Something happened to your leg? Yeah, twice. Actually, the first time, it was more like half my body. Knocked me out of the Rangers. This time, it's mostly just reminded me how useless I've gotten. BCM I'm shocked he wasn't happier about selling all the dinkies that never sell. <laughs> what happened? A few years back, we get a tip that some Legion slavers were holed up in this burnout house a few clicks from where we were stationed. We get there and it's deserted. No sign anyone's been there. I mean, nothing. As we're leaving, I hear something behind me. I turn around and there's this kid, just skin and bone, and he's looking up at us and he's scared half to death. Been hiding in a closet. What did you do? I go to grab him out of there and I notice he's holding something in his hand. Something metal. He shuts himself back in the closet and that's when I see the grenade he's left by my feet. They do it a lot, the Legion, using kids. They know we'll hesitate. Anyway, that was the first time. Second time, I fell down those stairs in front of the motel. Just in case I got to thinking I'd put it all behind me. Did 
Your body's injured, not your mind. You're king yourself if you think you're useless. Huh. <laughs> People don't exactly line up to find out what's in my head. Can't remember the last time someone suggested I knew something worth knowing. You know, maybe there's something I can do for you. Since you've gone to all the trouble of flattering a crippled old soldier, there's a move we have in the Rangers for knocking an opponent off his feet. Ooh. Save my butt a bunch of times, maybe it will for you too. Let me show you how it's done. You learned the Ranger Takedown special move. Use this technique and initiate a power attack while moving backwards. You'll drop your opponent to the ground. Sweet. Lil has learned some tricks from Ranger Andy, and her unarmed skills have increased. Awesome! Double improvement! We learned a new technique, and Willow has also improved. Do you eat pre-war food? I don't trust most of it, but I can't resist Fancy Lad snack cakes. Or <laughs> gumdrops. Or junk food. Ooh, but Salisbury steak? Ugh. Ugh. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not a huge fan of that either. Who's Willow, though? Oh, I don't know. Who is Willow? Howdy. Um, right, the quest we were on. Talking to people who might know things. I mean, when did we acquire her? Oh, we she joined us a while ago, and you started uh, uh, pretty much immediately hating her, as I recall. Um, basically, she showed up as we were leaving a uh, uh, raider-trapped in uh, police department, uh, and she joined us and was also requesting that we try to get her stuff back. We got most of her stuff back. And she's looking for one last item, which is owned, which is currently in the possession of a ghoul that she was uh, originally teamed up with. Welcome. Come on in. Yo. Welcome back. Can I get you anything? How about my money? <laughs> what can you tell me about Boone's wife? Can't say we spoke much. Boone did most of the buying for him. She was in the store once, but she didn't stay long. Had a look on her face like she'd smelled something sour. But far as I can remember, the gift shop smelled fine. Well, fine as it always does. All right, thanks. Come back soon now. Uh, was that uh, one last item, the rest of her shirt? <laughs> Actually, I just happened to think we can probably give her some of the armor I got. That we just stored away. We'll look into that in a bit. Um, ask around over here. Ooh. Hey there. Hey, Jeannie. I hope you're finding everything to your liking. What can you tell me about Boone's wife? How should I? Oh, god damn it! The game just got tabbed out. Give me a few moments. And here comes the second tab out, which usually happens. Now we should be good. Kinda like a cactus flower. Real pretty to look at, but there was just no getting close to her. She never did take to living here. She liked the big lights and fast living of New Vegas. I, I got the feeling she was trying to get Boone to live with her, but I guess she got tired of waiting. Uh, that's what people think, huh? All right, goodbye. Watch out for strangers. Yeah. Hello. 
Oh, uh, care mercenary for a caravan. Gotcha. Careful. Who sent you? I ain't talking. They tried to get me to talk before, but I didn't say nothing. And I don't aim to now, by gum. <laughs> We we'll tried to make you talk. Confounded, no bark. You've done it again. You let on that you know things. Now they'll never let you be. All right, stranger, you got me. What <clears throat> do you want to know? <laughs> what do you know about the abduction of Boone's wife? Seen it all. Seen shadowy folk come to his room and leave again in the middle of the night. Thought one might have gone in the lobby too for a spell. Could be that person went in to get something. Or used the John, maybe. Mighty interesting either way, you asked me. I thought it was cannibals, come to eat us all for sure. So I kept out of sight. But now I know better. Who was it? More rat men. Come up from the underneath to steal young women with promises of riches and fancy mud mansions with all the latest designer appliances. <laughs> they covered our lady folks' long hair for wigs, it said, being either bald or balding themselves. <laughs> oh, my word. Okay, I think I've heard enough. Thanks, no bark. If anyone asks, we never spoke. Sure thing. <laughs> Fancy mud. <laughs> oh, dear. Look for evidence of the guilty party inside the Dino Delight lobby. That's the front desk. Where's the lobby at? Do they mean the front desk when they say lobby? I can't tell. It's probably not wrong. <laughs> as crazy as some of these games can get, it's a possibility. Uh, just a uh, door to one of the rooms. Door to one of the rooms. A locked door to one of the rooms. In our room. Is there a lobby? Looking for the lobby. Careful. They got ah. spies all over. No bark again. Okay. This wouldn't happen to be no bark's house, would it? I hate to assume. Yo, I'm right. <laughs> Front desk is generally in the lobby. Oh. Okay, yeah, we're just getting on round here. Willow, go back the other way, Willow. Willow, so help me, Willow. Fought. Toaster. Empty, empty filing cabinets. Some of those souvenirs. Watching the stars above. Hoping that I could win back your love. I'm 
so blue without you thought our love was true then you found killed the bard <laughs> To the cash console farm, have a stay bargain to the purchase of Jeanine May Crawford, the township of Novak, the exclusive rights and ownership, the sale of the slave Harlan Boone for the sum of the thousand. Oh, you piece of work. Why'd you do it? Boone for the sum of one thousand ball caps and those of her child for the sum of the five. Finding everything to your liking. Watch out for strength. Holy cow. Boone, you won't believe it. Crack the case wide open. Oh wait, you're not Boone. You're Vargs. Uh, Boone must have gone off shift. Send someone in front of the dinky dinosaur put on the beret to signal Find that this is the culprit. You're finding everything. Um, uh, wait, how do we do this? Because we need to send her out front because obviously she's the one that did this now. Watch out for strength. Y'all checking that though. It was. Jean May Crawford, yeah. Jean May Crawford. Take out the brain to you out front, probably. Um that needs to be repaired. Poor hat. How 
do we get them to go out front though? Is that someone out front? Actually, uh, we also have to probably wait until uh, it's Boone's shift again. Which might be later in the day. Actually, that's a good question. Where does Boone live? <clears throat> have we seen it? Uh, local map. Boone's room. Okay, Boone's up here. Actually, he might be downstairs. Probably one of these two. Ah, Boone's room, and it's locked, which means he's probably resting. So you know what? Wait an hour. Let's go up here. Wait about two hours at a time. You shouldn't be here. If people know we talked, and if whoever did this smells a rat, they'll have the Legion after both of us. Leave it. Don't come here again. Gotta make sure that you were up there. And now that you're gonna be up there, <clears throat> I have someone I need to talk to. Not saving. Let's make sure of that. So I found some dirt. Hey there. Hi. I hope you're finding everything to your liking. Come with me. There's something you should see out in front of the dinosaur. Okay, if that's what you think. Sneaking up behind a gecko, right? And I'm about to break cover when suddenly a death claw runs up and grabs it. I swear, I peed my pants. <laughs> All right, that's to take care of, anyways. Keys and your safe and your glasses. Good day. <laughs> fucking god, kill it. <laughs> Howdy. Oh, 
cloudy. That's it then. How did you know? I found the bill of sale. I guess I shouldn't be surprised. It'd be like them to keep paperwork. Here. This is all I can give. I think our dealings are done here. What'll you do after this? I don't know. I won't be staying, I know that. Don't see much point in anything right now, except hunting legionaries. Maybe I'll wander. Like you. Tell them about his child. No, that's that child was Genie's unborn child, but I'm not sure where that came from. That was part of the deal, apparently as well. Yeah. <laughs> um. We can offer him to come with us, or ask him if he's an outlaw now. I guess we can at least ask that. No. People die out there. Often enough that no one worries about blame. They're too anxious to forget it happened in the first place, I guess. Besides, I was on break when it happened. Do we offer him to come along? Do we want more people in our party? Vixia, I like him. Yes. All right. Come with me if you want to leave. You don't want to do that. We'll kill more with two of us. Yeah, that might be true. That's reason enough for me to take you up on it, I suppose. But this isn't going to end well. Fine. Let's get out of here. Giving you the spotter perk. Okay. Old buddy, old pal. <laughs> Achievement unlocked. How you doing? I'm doing good. How about you? Ask him if he wants a dinky. <laughs> Do you want a dinky? What is it? No. Yeah. Okay. Nothing about that. So, all right. Want a dinky? I'll give you a dinky if you want a dinky. Dinkies. Alright. So let me check the overworld map. So we got some crazy stuff to look up now. US one rough contest site. Let's go that way. 
We are in the hour. All right, so we'll actually probably pause it as we're getting out of town here. So uh, I hope you all enjoyed. We got a nice little story, side story done there. We got a new, uh, new member of our team, uh, and we're going to continue this tomorrow night. So don't forget to like, share, subscribe, uh, and follow along, depending on where you're watching. And if you want to see more, don't forget to comment below and spread the word. And if you really want to help more directly, you can also help out by either uh, subscribing to the Twitch streams, and you can get the nice little emotes I've made so far. Or you can also help out by uh, checking down the links down below, and maybe uh, helping fund us on Patreon or something else of the like. But no badge. We'll work on that. <laughs> I haven't had time. Uh, but anyways, that's going to be uh, it for now. Th I thank you all again for tuning in, and I will see you all next time. Have a good evening. He's a smoker.